you've also been critical recently of uh, Republicans, including President Trump, who have made baseless accusations about the election and the results there. Uh, there's another uh, Republican in Illinois, Darren Bailey, uh, now a state senator-elect, uh, a representative who uh, had some words for you. We've got many uh, Illinois Republican leaders throughout the state calling for Donald Trump to step down, calling for him to, to give up. Um, that's appalling. Adam Kinzinger, uh, a U.S. congressman from the northern part of the state, seems to be leading this charge. He's been calling for quite some time for uh, Donald Trump to uh, just give up, concede, and, and get out of the way. Get on his uh, Twitter and Facebook accounts and tell him to get his priorities straight if he's a Republican, otherwise change his party. I, I wonder if you can respond to uh, Senator-elect Bailey. Well, I mean, it sounds like he's just trying to get some attention or trying to set himself up for whatever that is. That's fine. I, I understand that he wants to be known. But the bottom line is this. What I analyze everything I do through is, you know, I think you can have spirited battles in politics. I think you have to have spirited battles in politics. But the thing that this country has always held dear is that we have peaceful transitions of power that we accept election results. If you have evidence of fraud, that's very important to bring out, but if you don't, accusations alone don't count. And that misinformation itself can be devastating to a country that governs itself. And I'm gonna continue to be clear on that. As I have for 10 years in politics, quite honestly, uh, you know, my accountability is to my district, to God, and that's it, not to Mr. Bailey or anybody else. And the bottom line is, I want this country to succeed and the ability to have a peaceful transition to power is key to that.